Here in mid-Michigan, ceremonies also took place to honor those who gave their lives for America. We went to several events today, and we begin in Mason, where 6 News reporter Ray Sherman was on hand for their Memorial Day parade. Today, the city of Mason hosted a Memorial Day service to remember those that lost their lives to the war. Officials say they show honor by reading the names of individuals, specifically from Ingham County. My year's not complete unless I come here. There's just something missing about it because it's, I don't know, we owe them so much that we just can never repay it. Many gathered holding loved ones close, including Leon Clark, whose uncle passed away in the war. It's a tough day. Um, I have family members. I have an uncle that, was, that died in the Korean War. Um, it's, it's a tough day. After the Mason County Courthouse ceremony, the Memorial Day Parade took place at Bond Park, with the Mason High School marching band playing throughout the city. <laughs> and even though people are out celebrating their day off, officials want to make sure that people do not forget the true meaning of Memorial Day. They fought for our ability to have a day where we can go and barbecue and everything else, but if we don't start it out with giving them the honor and respect that they deserve, um, it's just not, to me, it's just not right. Enjoy your day, enjoy your boat, have a drink, but remember these people that gave their lives so you could enjoy this day. Here for Don Mason, Ray Sherman, 6 News. Meridian Township also held a service today honoring and paying respect to those who have served in our military. It was held at Glendale Cemetery. During the ceremony, the Meridian Community Band provided a musical tribute. Local scout troops led the color guard and special presentations were given out. And the city of Leslie held a parade today featuring veterans, bands, bicycles, tractors, fire trucks and emergency vehicles. The parade eventually stopped at Veterans Memorial Park for a moment of remembrance. Governor Whitmer issued a statement in honor of Memorial Day, saying in part, On Memorial Day, I urge all Michiganders to take part in honoring our nation's fallen heroes. Attend a parade, seek out a local event, and make sure we continue wrapping our arms around those who have lost a loved one. Together, let's continue supporting our service members, veterans, and their families as we build a stronger, safe Michigan for all.